Fox Toledo News at 10 starts right now. It is overtime for the Ohio Highway Patrol, and that could mean jail time for you if you're not smart this holiday weekend. Troopers are out all over the area looking for bad drivers or drunk ones. Barrett Andrews is going to show you firsthand. He's on the scene with the story. If you're planning on heading out this Labor Day weekend, troopers say just use common sense. Don't drink and drive, and oh yeah, don't forget to uh, buckle your seatbelt. We're putting people in the places they need to be uh, to combat drunk driving, to combat um, aggressive driving. Lately, that's been the Veterans Class City Skyway, a stretch of I-280 where some people apparently think there is no speed limit. We have a lot of uh, really aggressive driving going across the bridge. Uh, we had several uh, contacts just today over 100 miles per hour. Uh, troopers stopped one for 109 miles per hour. Another trooper stopped another one for 103 miles per hour just coming across the bridge. That 103 mile per hour speed demon just 16 years old. That's why a big part of these troopers' jobs is education, not just giving out tickets, but explaining what people did wrong and why it's important they don't do it again, like seatbelts. Out in the county that we're responsible for, usually seatbelt usage is upward 90 percent. Um, we get closer to the city, the seatbelt usage drops off quite a bit. That's why the sergeant likes to hit places like Miami Street, where he found this driver not buckled up. Needless to say, he did buckle up before he drove off, ticket in hand. Usually they don't argue with you about it. They realize, you know, the right thing to do is to buckle up. And uh, usually you see these people again and they usually have their seatbelt on. Now, seatbelt fines vary from city to city, so there's not an exact number on that. But troopers say if you drink and drive, there is one uniform punishment, jail. We're on the scene in downtown Toledo. Barrett Andrews, Fox Toledo News.